iOS is iTech every week, and I got a post here on Reddit and Pi uh, that allows you to download iOS 5.0.1 uh, for the iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. Uh, it is supposed to be for developers only. Uh, so if you have your UDID number uh, registered uh, with an Apple developer account, which I actually do, uh, to do this, you either have to pay $100 a year to become an Apple developer uh, using your Apple ID, or uh, I actually paid 5 bucks to uh, someone, and they put me on their Apple dev account, uh, so that allows my UDID to be registered with an Apple dev, and that allows me to restore to the softwares that Af the Apple uh, releases uh, that are meant for developers only. Uh, but anyway... A lot of people have been noticing there's been a lot of problems with the battery issues with iOS 5, uh, mostly in the, uh, the iPhone 4S because of Siri and all this other stuff going on. Uh, and the iPhone 4S just has a lot more stuff running, so the battery on that is mostly uh, the, the biggest problem uh, right now. So they, re they went ahead and they released 5.0.1 to developers only. This post actually doesn't have um, download links available. I'll most likely, I think I have a link uh, that I found on Twitter that gives you the downloads. So if I, if I actually do have, well, I'm not positive on that yet or not, but if I do, just check the description and you'll be able to download this. But make sure you do have to know uh, that you got your UDID registered with an Apple Dev account. So I just want to make this video really quickly to kind of uh, tell you guys there's an update coming out. Uh, if you aren't an Apple Dev, uh, you shouldn't have to wait much longer uh, for this update to come out. And also, uh, if, you, if you are running 5.0.1 already or you plan on running it, it has been jailbroken already. So if we actually go back to the Rumman Pi homepage... Uh, let's see here, jailbreak right here, and uh, yeah, so they've already jailbroken iOS uh, 5.0.1. You can see right here, iPhone 4 GSM iOS 5.0.1, and there's Cydia. So it has been jailbroken already, and I'm not exactly sure which Red Snow. It looks like it is right here, Red Snow 0.9.9 Beta 5. Uh, actually, there's a newer one out. I'm not sure if it's will jailbreak it or not, but I believe there's a newer one out uh, right here, Red Snow 0.9.9. Beta 7. That is the newest one out. I'm not sure if that'll work or not. This one says Beta 5. So I'll go ahead and put uh, this jailbreak link in here. I'll put uh, this link in here for you guys, and if I have the actual direct download links for iOS 5.0.1, I'll also go ahead and throw those in the description. Just so make sure you check the description for the links, and I'll uh, try to remember to get those links put in there as soon as possible. That's it for this video, guys. I just want to go ahead and update with this and let you know that there is a uh, new update coming out for the iDevice lineup uh, to help fix that battery issue, and that should be out here in a little bit. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and like it down below and subscribe up top to be notified uh, with different tech information along with jailbreak tutorials and news on the jailbreaks themselves, like the untethered for iOS 5, uh, which is everyone is patiently waiting for. Uh, that should also be uh, coming out within a month, I'm going to assume. So that's it for this video, guys. This is iTech of a week. Let me enjoy the rest of your night, and I'll see you in the next video.